Welcome to Mercenary Field here in Chirac, Illinois, home of the Midway Mutants. Also home of the White Schlocks and the Flubs. Also home of the most state politicians in Jail Hall of Fame. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Purple Mutant Eaters go up against the Midway Mutants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're going to love seeing mutants not cold, their brains turned into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. NFL game day is on the air. Oh, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm going to go get some extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. First and ten. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down and five. Second down and a lot. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> Second down and a mile. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, boy. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Punter gets paid way too much. To, can he just let that one drop and play it safe? And the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. And he runs it for four yards.
Second down and six. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. They're taking what the defense has given them. It's with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. Third and two. And that's a pick. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Whenever a player gets big like this, it reminds me of that Tom Hanks movie. And then hit jars, the ball loose, and it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle and take a hard hit. Boom, dead and down. You delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah. Didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. Third down and ten. Well, oh, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he's got a chance for a good return hit. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. And it's first and ten. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's
yards, first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. First and ten. He picks up ten yards on that play. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh could it be mine? Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. With a burst of speed, he finds an opening and the first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. He refuses to go down. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Third down and eight. You can't keep a good mutant down. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had shown on today. Looks like it's a good fit. Second and eight to go. And he just slipped away. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon, did it? How good can it be? Third down and three. Oh, good heads up play there, getting it out of bounds. Better than throwing a pick. Come on, nice and easy, right through the uprights. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My turn on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes, I like it. Like a patient prison break. Second down and two. Oh, and he just turns right and he fumbles it, Bricks. That was a screwed-up play if I ever saw one. Third and four. Kids, do you remember getting shoved in a locker because you wore? You've got to catch that.
You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Man, he's such bullshit. This game is fucking rigged. I tell you, the programmers are speeding up the defense. I'm going to write an email to that fucker. Hey, hey, what you talking about, Pop? And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. for big yardage on that play. They're back in business, Bricks. My mom told me to stay out of other people's businesses, Grim. Third down and a sliver. <laughs> that ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. That'd be fantastic. For a kick this far, you just got to kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim. It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. He's got the distance, and the kick is good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It, it means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover. Oh, a vicious hit. And the ref will have to administer last rites. Funeral services to be held Monday at the Church of Holy Crap. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And it's first and ten. That's a four-yard gain. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. Second down and six. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and six. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Man, those bones can boogie. The lack of muscle, fat, organs, and skin really makes it easy for him to dance. And they line up for the extra point. right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. <laughs> and it's
It's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to go oh, with the brain scrambler. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sex. I'm talking about... And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to... Jo Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Man, this rip is definitely on the take. That was a bogus penalty. And the court defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two minute drill. And it's first and ten. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. On that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. I'm going to wreck it. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Though? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. I personally think the ginormous guy is compensating. Fumble! you got to protect the ball better than that. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. Listen to his fans howl. They love him. He came up as a teenage werewolf in the Mutant Farm League. I don't know if he's dancing or just marking his territory. <laughs> you know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. He is fighting for. 
for every arm. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Oh, with the brutal hit. First and four. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. I turned out the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed, it was a chick wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And he runs it for four yards. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. I think they want to hit those last two runners for this Ackman. Third down and five. He should apply for the Mutant Volleyball League. Hey, uh, don't give the fans any ideas. The commission already spends all day on Twitter shooting down rumors. Oh, boy, they're going for it. This could get uglier than the baby result. The Roid Raid's dirty trick transforms a player into a rampaging... And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. <laughs> Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Oh, with the punishing hit. Yeah, you're done for time. Oh. 
The offense is down to their last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. And it's first and ten. Well, why go for one when you can go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about points. And he, and he runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Well, those are just my balls. Hey, hey, for sharing, Bricks. Yeah, man, I was huge on the now. You know what I <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Man, what a hit that was! And it's first and ten. for 10 yards. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Oh, it's a player's favorite. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, win. they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the funeral expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. That's a two-yard pass play, and that's not going to get it done. The offense needs to... Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. And that'll be second and eight to go. Third down and, well, good luck. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a... Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite, Dave, because he's the one who just got wiped out. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? And that'll be second down and four. And he just slipped away like a greased pig. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. Does the QB know that, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit? And it's first and ten. Intercepted. (laughs) 
second down and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have how? And how about a little dirt sandwich? First and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Bring the ball to explode, and the defensive player got blown to bits. <laughs> They're down and ten. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice his way through any defensive player trying to block it. And like a monkey trying to, and like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell here. It might be time to change the channel. I think Heidi's playing on Superstation WKRP. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. And he picks up and that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. The quarterback goes into a hurry up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we are, Grim. We are. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. Uh, come on, man. You got to catch that. I don't catch anything, Grim. I'm retired. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense... Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh, and that's how you play defense. 
Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run the football. First down. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Do us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. Second down and more than the QB would like. Whoa. Looks like a pass and it's bouncing right. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the NFL. down and never going to happen. And he's off to the races. He's at the 20 and they're catching up. Jump, jump, do something. First and four. to go somewhere but he gets stumped after three they usually stop me after three too you know the all-you-can-eat buffets they're not as literal as you think and that'll bring up second and one now the offense is getting kills this is really a violent game oh mama just call him cap and crunch another one bites the dust running back no rest for the weary the last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die and that'll bring up second defense says enough of this bs and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee way to go guys Bring up second and one. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Yeah, <laughs> 
The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And it plays a defense, schmuck. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry? Looks like the defense called the ginormous dirty trick. That's a hole. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. First and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving. Oh, what the brutal hit! First and ten. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Now the QB is dinking and dunking the defense to sleep. <laughs> One yard on that pass. And the Dean takes their second time out, hoping for a miracle. I witnessed a miracle once. A player was brought back from the dead. That's not a miracle, partner. That's just how the MFL works. <laughs> and he punched his way out of that tackle. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. And the MFL winning is really about boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? One, one, two, one, one. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points. At some point, they're going to need to put this rep out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance? Here's a hit. Dirty tricks. And this is a first and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And it's 
It's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hey. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. And defense burns its last time out. You can't take them into the locker room, so you might as well use them now. Why would you want to take a time out into the locker room, Grim? That doesn't sound right. Hot. Hot. One. Hot. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Yeah. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Hey. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a frog in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused! First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. Boom! Dead and down! He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill... Check one in the win column. The are victorious. Folks, this wasn't even close. It was a total shellacky, like watching a knife cut through butter. More like an axe through butter, Grim. More like a chainsaw through baby shit, because that pretty much describes what we just saw. And the MVP of today's game is just about to speak. As soon as he gets his jaw back in place. Oh, there he's got it now. Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...